lifestyle lovers welcome back to it's e lifestyle and if you are new here welcome my name is erica my channel is called it's e lifestyle and it is all about creating a good lifestyle okay lifestyle lovers you guys are not going to believe this but um the last vlog you seen i was on vacation i went to cabo cabo i had a real good time i've been back from vacation five days on day three i was diagnosed with the rona so i am on day three of quarantine um and this is probably the best that I felt since I um, tested positive. So I just decided to kind of cut on the camera and talk to you guys. But um, nobody else in, um, that went on the girls trip, nobody else uh, got, got the Rona but me. Um, when I got back, I took a day and I rested. I did not go back to work immediately. But I woke up the next morning with a sore throat because we got back um, probably about 11 o'clock at night. And so I just kind of chilled for that day. I had a big meeting the next day, my leadership meeting. So um, I did take a test on the day after I got back and it was negative. The next morning I had my leadership meeting. I woke up with a terrible headache. My head was hurting so bad. Um, so I tested then and it was negative. So I just kind of felt like, you know, maybe I was coming down with something, but it wasn't the Rona. I struggled all day through the meeting with my head just pounding. I didn't feel good. I felt terrible. I came home. I took some night quill. I slept, woke up, took some night quill, slept again, woke up that morning getting ready for work still not feeling good but i was just like erica you've been off work for weeks it's time for you to carry your tail back to work took a test that morning and i was positive so um i'm feeling probably i'm probably about 60 percent better um i'm not doing as much coughing just a little bit um but now it's like my digestive system is i don't know it's churning or whatever um so i just talked to my friend he's gonna bring me some alkaline water because i'm all out of water i drunk up all the water in the house there's not a lick of water unless it's coming out the faucet um and then he's gonna bring me some fruit so i'm just trying to eat light because my stomach sounds like a gorilla is inside me but i'm i'm just here doing some unpacking i have some stuff i kind of pulled out a lot of the things that I that I bought for my trip, I, well, not bought for my trip, but a lot of things that I took for my trip, I did not wear. So I always overpack. But um, here's like, um, this is everything that I wore, and this is everything that I did not get a chance to wear. So if you guys seen the maintenance vlog where I went out and bought those swimsuits from Target, I wore none of those swimsuits that I purchased from Target. Um, the stuff that I purchased from Shein, I wore none of that. Well, I wore one outfit from Shein, which was this one. It's like a skirt set. I don't even think you guys seen this because I had closed the vlog out. But it was like a um, like a two-piece set. I'll insert a picture of that. But this turned out really, really cute. Um, I also wore this, which I purchased from J Lux Label. It was really, really long. I'll insert a picture of this as well on the model because I did not get a good picture with this. So, you know, if you did not get a good picture, it don't count. But this is like a vacation outfit, so I probably wouldn't wear this anywhere other than vacation. But um, I'm just kind of like unpacking my stuff. I did get a chance to wear my Versace swimsuit. Um, so I'm glad I purchased this for my trip. And uh, what else? Oh, this. I don't think I shared this with you guys, but I brought this at the last minute. This was a good last minute buy. 
it is like a wrap skirt from Express. And then it has like the one shoulder top. So this, I'm glad I purchased this, but this turned out really, really cute. This is something else that I wore. My red dress from Venus. A lot of you guys ask about this dress, but this was actually in the collaboration that I did with Venus. And um, this was just like an extra outfit, but it photographed so beautifully. Um, and also this two piece set from Mio and Barks. Um, I thought it was sold out, but it's actually still available. So you can order it online if you're not here in Jacksonville, but she may have it in the store. Um, and then I just, you know, my cutoff shorts and what else? Yeah, my swimsuit from Venus. And this is a kimono that I ordered from Amazon to go with my swimsuit. So I'll link all that stuff below again. It's in the vlog. Um, but I just kind of felt good enough to come on camera and talk to you guys. There's a lot. We're well, probably not a lot going to be going on in this vlog. But um, there's a lot that I want to share. I sold my sofa. <laughs> and I ordered a new one, which is coming. I sold the, well, not, I didn't sell them, but they're for sale. These two chairs are for sale. That's why the living room is kind of spaced out. I have my coffee table over here, but I sold, well, it's for sale. It's not sold yet, but the sofa is for sale and the two chairs for sale because I have a sofa and two chairs coming. So um, I'm just gonna go ahead and get unpacked. I, this is like the best that I felt. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, get unpacked and then I'll check back in with you guys. But I'm doing much better, lifestyle lovers. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. So yeah, I'll check back in with you guys a little later. unpacking I, I did get quite a bit done and then I started to get a little tired so I noticed I'm just my energy is very very low although I'm feeling better my energy is low so um I'm back on the sofa y'all with some cover um every time I get the feel like I got a, I got some energy to do 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 something around the house. I'll get up and try to do something, but I can't. I can't do it for no longer than like an hour. So, um my friend did bring me some um alkaline water. So, I'm going to drink my water. I ate some fruit. I ate a lunchable because my stomach is kind of it's it's doing its own thing. Um and I think I'm gonna go get back in the bed, take another nap. I'm so tired of this house, I don't know what to do. 
I'll be glad when it's over with, but um, I guess I'll check back in with you guys tomorrow. I thought I was going to be able to kind of finish cleaning up the living room, but I just don't have the energy to do it. So, see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow be day four quarantine. Good afternoon, lifestyle lovers. So today is um it's the next day it's actually day four of me um being in quarantine and i am feeling probably the best that i have felt <laughs> since i returned from vacation i'm still a little congested i don't know if you guys can um can hear it in my voice but i'm still a little congested but i have energy so um i was able to um, muscle up some energy to finish unpacking. I did do that and I kind of been cleaning up bleaching everything down. I just Basically got one of my empty spray bottles. I just basically Took one of my empty spray bottles. I filled it up with some hot water Added some bleach and I just been wiping everything down all of the baseboards all of the walls Anything that could not get faded from bleach, I've been wiping it down because hopefully my son will be back home this week. He's been with his dad for like two weeks. He's ready to come home. I miss him. He misses me. His dad is ready to, ready to get rid of him. And we're actually planning the kids' summer vacation this upcoming weekend. So hopefully I'll get a clean bill of health and I can join my family on the vacation. If not, they're just gonna have to enjoy without me um, because health first. And I just wanna make sure, you know, I protect everyone else, but I am feeling better, a whole lot better. Um, so this pretty much was just like a check-in vlog, Lifestyle Lovers. Um, I did kinda tell you about some items that I'm getting rid of in the living room. So I just wanted to kinda show you what's going and what's staying. This is my living area. I just kinda push the coffee table back. So the coffee table is of course staying. I love this coffee table. It's made by Hooker Furniture. If you're, if you're new here, it's made by Hooker Furniture and I believe it's discontinued. Um, these two coffee tables, I mean side tables, are from Z Gallery. Those two are staying. Um, and this couch is for sale, as well as these two accent chairs are also for sale. I'm going to, at some point, get rid of the rug, but I have not found a replacement. And these pictures on the wall... I've already sold those. Matter of fact, I think I'm going to go ahead and just take them down now. Because um, I'm kind of waiting until I get well and then that way we'll do the, um, the exchange. But I'm going to go ahead and take these off the wall now. been noticing lifestyle lovers is you know as I've been kind of um, wiping down baseboards I definitely need a fresh coat of paint in my home um, so of course there's holes in the walls but what I'm going to do is actually it's going to be a large piece of artwork here just one large piece of artwork um, I already have it picked out I believe I'm going to have to um get with um the vendor that i use here in jacksonville when i order um particular pieces and see how long it'll take before it'll be here um 
So that's coming down. So probably when you guys see this, my living area again, everything will be totally, completely switched out. But I just wanted to kind of check in with you guys, let you know, you know, what was going on, let you know what is yet to come. There was something else that I wanted to share with you guys before I close out the video. I think I said this on a previous video, but I went ahead and purchased some door handles for my shelves next to the fireplace. Um, so these are the ones that I purchased and I purchased those from Home Depot. Um, they're actually cheaper on Amazon, but I got these from Home Depot. These are the handles that was there before I purchased these. So I just have to go ahead and, um, and change these out to these particular handles, which are five inch handles. I can't remember. I think they probably were like five or six dollars from Home Depot, but they're way cheaper on Amazon. They're probably like a dollar or two dollars a piece if you purchase them from Amazon. But these are the previous handles. And these are the new handles, which I like a lot better than the black. So I'm going to go ahead and just. Um, change these out. I think I'm gonna clean the patio off because I just feel like I need to I need to get outside and that's the only way I can get outside is to get outside around my home but um that's it for this video lifestyle lovers it's probably gonna be a real short vlog but I kind of wanted to check in with you guys um after my vacation let you know you know what was going on um and just what to look forward to we're about to get back on the home things as soon as i get well i'm going to schedule to have the countertops installed so i'm hoping if i get a clean bill of health this week i'm hoping they can get installed next week so there is a lot of home stuff coming up so if you're not subscribed make sure you subscribe before you click off this video i hope you have a great week a great weekend whenever you're watching this and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.